Having achieved a better understanding of brain functioning in the teaching and learning process, Eric Jensen turns our attention to those brain-related issues that can impair learning. It is critical that today's teachers and administrators are not only aware of those factors that can impair brain functioning, but more importantly, develop specific positive strategies that either minimize the harmful effects and or build new pathways that can motivate and improve student learning. We're going to focus on what impairs learning and what you can do to improve it. We've learned a lot about how the brain learns, but sometimes, in spite of all we do right, the student still doesn't learn. What is going on? Our purpose in this training video is twofold. First, to provide a survey of just some of the things that can go wrong with the student brain that are relevant to learning. And second, to help you identify those problems and help you learn what you can do to help all students learn. Our topics will be the following. The emotional brain, what's the impact of threats and how to avoid them. The attentional brain, what do we know about attention deficit disorder. The depressed brain, more students are depressed than you think. The helpless brain, how to identify and treat learned helplessness. The violent or abused brain, how to recognize the symptoms of abuse. The chemical brain, students who use drugs. And the fragile brain, how to deal with student trauma and brain insults. Right before we start, two quick reminders. First, research tells us that most things that go wrong with the brain can be treated. Sometimes it takes some well-applied, tender, loving care, but in more extreme cases, it takes comprehensive treatments that involve lifestyle changes, parental support, medications, and therapy. So the message I want you to get first is, wow, I didn't realize all the things that could go wrong with the brain, but then I want you to think, hey, I can better identify the things that go wrong with the brain and learn what to do about it. 